Welcome to the world of Rooster Cogburn, a 1975 film that seamlessly blends grit with humor, starring the iconic pairing of John Wayne and Katherine Hepburn. Before we delve into the intriguing aspects of this Western classic, let me pose a question. Out of the many roles in this movie, which one was your favorite? Or perhaps, when was the first time you watched this movie? Now, let's set the stage for some random facts about the show. Rooster Cogburn serves as both a sequel and a loose remake, bringing back Wayne's portrayal of the cantankerous U.S. Marshall Rooster Cogburn, first seen in the 1969 film True Grit. Hepburn, on the other hand, adds her own flavor to the mix, creating a dynamic chemistry that adds depth to the narrative. This film not only showcases the rugged landscapes of the Wild West, but also explores themes of justice, redemption, and unlikely alliances. The story follows Rooster and Eula Goodnight as they embark on a perilous mission to bring a band of outlaws to justice. The film's narrative prowess lies not only in its action-packed sequences, but in the nuanced portrayal of its characters, making it a standout in the genre. Now, let me leave you with a thought. What's your most cherished memory or personal experience related to this movie? We would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. And that's a wrap on our introduction to Rooster Cogburn, a cinematic journey that continues to captivate audiences. So, out of curiosity, what's your favorite part of this classic Western? Share your thoughts below and let the conversation begin. Rooster Cogburn, released in 1975, is a classic Western film directed by Stuart Miller, featuring the iconic pairing of John Wayne as Rooster Cogburn and Katherine Hepburn as Eula Goodnight. The movie is a loose sequel to the 1969 film True Grit, with Wayne reprising his role as the rough and tumble U.S. Marshall Rooster Cogburn. Set against the backdrop of the American frontier, the story follows the unlikely alliance between the one-eyed, hard-drinking Codburn and the prim and proper missionary Eula Goodnight. Together, they embark on a quest to bring justice to the Wild West, chasing down outlaws and facing various challenges along the way. The film's unique blend of action, humor, and heartfelt moments showcases the chemistry between Wayne and Hepburn, elevating Rooster Codburn beyond a typical Western. The narrative explores themes of justice, redemption, and the transformative power of unlikely partnerships. The film's enduring appeal lies not only in its engaging plot, but also in its portrayal of the complex characters and the chemistry between the lead actors. Rooster Cogburn has left an indelible mark on popular culture, contributing to the legacy of the Western genre. John Wayne's portrayal of Rooster Cogburn became an iconic representation of the rugged, no-nonsense cowboy, solidifying his status as a legendary figure in film history. The movie's success also paved the way for more collaborations between Wayne and Hepburn, showcasing their on-screen dynamic. The film's impact is further underscored by its continued popularity and influence, making it a timeless classic in the realm of Western cinema. In summary, Rooster Cogburn is a captivating Western that not only serves as a sequel to True Grit, but also stands on its own as a testament to the enduring appeal of the genre. With memorable characters, a compelling narrative, and the stellar performances of its lead actors, the film has etched itself into the cultural fabric of cinema, leaving an indomitable legacy that continues to resonate with audiences. John Wayne faced formidable challenges during the making of Rooster Cogburn in 1975. Fresh off a demanding shoot for Brannigan and recovering from pneumonia, Wayne found the production physically taxing. Despite being promoted as Rooster Cogburn, the film's opening credits simply bear the title Rooster Cogburn. The promotional strategy, it seems, differed from the actual presentation. Adding to the difficulty, Wayne, already working with one lung for a decade, encountered breathing problems at high altitudes, necessitating the use of an oxygen mask. An injury sustained while teaching his daughter golf during filming went unnoticed, thanks to Rooster Cogburn's iconic eye patch. These behind-the-scenes challenges, coupled with Wayne's commitment to his role amid personal health struggles, provide a unique lens through which to appreciate the making of this classic Western. The physical toll endured by Wayne, both on and offset, underscores the dedication poured into Rooster Cogburn, contributing to its enduring legacy in the realm of Western cinema. Catherine Hepburn's resilience on the set of Rooster Cogburn left a lasting impression on John Wayne. He marveled at her determination, 
especially during challenging mountain locations. Wayne, recalling her unconventional approach to horse riding scenes, noted, You should have seen her up on those mountain locations. She can't ride a hobby horse, but she climbed right up on those horses and gave them hell. Hepburn, in turn, found amusement in Wayne's confrontational nature, particularly his penchant for arguing with everyone, including the director. At the rap party, she quipped, "In glad I didn't know you when you had two lungs. You must have been a real bastard. Losing a hip has mellowed me, but you. These contrasting anecdotes from the lead actors shed light on the unique dynamics behind the scenes of Rooster Cogburn. The rugged determination of Hepburn and the no-nonsense attitude of Wayne, both on and off the screen, added layers to the making of this classic western. Such behind-the-scenes revelations provide a fascinating glimpse into the personalities that contributed to the film's enduring legacy in the realm of Western cinema. The on-screen chemistry between Wayne and Hepburn is complemented by the authenticity of their off-screen interactions. This interplay between the two iconic actors, driven by Hepburn's tenacity and Wayne's spirited demeanor, creates a compelling narrative beyond the script. It is a testament to the complexity of characters both in front of and behind the camera, contributing to the timeless appeal of Rooster Codburn. In addition to the actors' interactions, the film's authenticity is further underscored by its adherence to the source material. The conversation between Rooster and Wolf, discussing the small gun loan to him, is directly lifted from an unused line of dialogue in the novel True Grit. This meticulous attention to detail adds depth to the narrative, showcasing the filmmaker's commitment to staying true to the essence of the story. In conclusion, Rooster Cogburn, beyond being a compelling western on the surface, is enriched by the behind-the-scenes anecdotes that reveal the dedication and authenticity of its cast. The interplay between John Wayne and Catherine Hepburn, coupled with the film's faithfulness to the source material, cements its status as a timeless classic in the western genre. As the credits roll and the echoes of Rooster Codburn's adventures fade away, I invite you to embark on your own journey of reflection. The 1975 film, a tapestry woven with grit, determination, and a touch of the Wild West's untamed spirit, leaves an indelible mark on those who dare to ride alongside the one-eyed marshal. What memories does Rooster Codburn stir within the recesses of your cinematic heart? Is it the rugged landscapes, the clash of justice against lawlessness, or the spirited banter between John Wayne and Catherine Hepburn that resonates most profoundly with you? Perhaps it's the moments of vulnerability that reveal the human beneath the cowboy hat, a reminder that even the toughest of souls have their frailties. Take a moment to pen down your thoughts, share your favorite scenes, or recall an instance when Rooster's unyielding courage inspired your own. Whether you first encountered the film in the dusty glow of a small town theater or streamed it in the comfort of your living room, Rooster Codburn becomes a timeless companion, a tale that transcends its temporal confines. In a world constantly evolving, there's something magical about revisiting the classics. So, as you navigate the labyrinth of your memories connected to Rooster Codburn, remember that you're not alone. Countless others have been touched by the same cinematic magic, and your story adds to the collective tapestry of shared experiences. Thank you for allowing Rooster Codburn to ride shotgun in your thoughts, for letting the dust of his adventures settle in the corridors of your mind. Your connection with this cinematic gem enriches the legacy it leaves behind. Until we meet again on the trails of nostalgia, happy reflections, and may your memories of Rooster Codburn always be as vivid as a prairie sunset. Warm regards and cowboy nods.